Noma in lane one. Dillard, lane two. Doan in three. Southeastern in four. Dort in five. Xavier, Louisiana in six. Marion, lane seven. William Carey, lane eight. And St. Thomas in lane nine. The final event of these championships is the men's four by four. And it will begin in a moment. The final event of the 2024 NAIA Outdoor Track and Field Championship is underway. The men's 4x4. Four four. Each runner will run an entire lap. These first ones have to keep in their own lanes. It looks good for William and Carey on the outside. Marion holding their own line. Dort looking very strong out of lane number 5. Making up some ground on Xavier, Louisiana. We'll know more as they come off the turn. The stagger will be erased this next time by. When they come off this far corner, they will be able to funnel in, the second runners will, and rooting interest for those who've been watching these broadcasts, Matt Boss, his son, senior Devin Boss, running for Dort, is about to take the baton as the Dort defenders, the favorite in the event, are off and running, their first handoff. Dort looking very good. On the outside, St. Thomas looking very strong. Marion is in position but they need to finish second or better. Right now, Marion is running about third, although Multnoma, correction, Dillard on the inside is looking very good. Marion looking to either be second or first. Second gives them a tie of a title. First gives them the outright. They are running in third place at the moment behind the favorite Dort, Dort who is running behind St. Thomas of Florida. Dort losing some ground. Marion working on the outside. The Knights needing second or first are running in second at the moment. This would tie them the title if they can keep it and they make a move for the outside. Marion trying to keep that lead. It's a battle, it's a four-way lead at the handoff for the third time, the penultimate handoff, and the race is on. William Carey has the lead at the moment. Dort running second, Marion in third. That won't do it for them, they need to move up. Dillard running in fourth at the moment. Down the back stretch, it is William Carey that leads, looking to play spoiler. Dort running in, in second. Marion in third. It's a one, two, three at the top, and they're all strung out towards the back. William Carey leads the final handoff. The anchor lap is going to be very consequential for the Marion Knights. They have to finish second or first, and they're going to be in position to, to do that, but they need to make up some ground. William Carey has the lead. Marion fans out. They're going to hit the line as simultaneously, and the final lap is on. 400 meters for a national title. Dort leads, Marion running in third, right behind William Carey. Carey lost the, William Carey lost the lead on that last handoff. Dort the favorite, has the lead right now. Marion has ground to make up. They have to at least pass William Carey if they can't catch Dort. Right now they're in third. If you are Cumberlands, you're in good shape, although Marion is still in contact. Dort, the number one team in this event, has the lead coming off the turn. Here comes Dort. Here comes Marion. Can Marion make a move? Dort has the lead. Dort's going to win. But will Marion get a share of the title? It's down to the wire. Dort does cross the line first. Marion does not. William Carey gets second. And Cumberlands will win the men's championship.
The final, Dort wins in three minutes, 6.3, which is just under a second off the